Hello, welcome or welcome back to my channel. This is Amanda, otherwise known as the Tangle Skeins Crafter. And I am here to do a really quick July wrap up August plans. Um, it's gonna be pretty quick because one, I really need to go to bed. And two, I don't remember exactly what I worked on in July. Um, took a few pictures, um, beginning pictures. So at least I know I worked on a few things. <laughs> It's just been a really busy month. Um, let's get into it. Okay, so in July, I worked on my Usagi girl. Usagi? I can't not remember how to say it. A little bit. You could tell I was planning on working more because I still have the needle in it. And. I was mostly doing, I think, this lavender collar, and I think some of this, I'll have a picture up, but I did not get very much done on her. I don't know what it is. I, I love the image, but I don't love stitching on it, and I don't know why, but it is what it is. I keep her nearby, because I like to work, I want to work on her. I shouldn't say I like you, because I don't really like you. I still get much done on her when I do work on her. You might hear my daughter moving around in the background. She's cleaning in preparation for us leaving. Um, I don't think I worked on her this month. I was going to do another stitch with me and I didn't so yeah I have not worked on her Sorry, I'm just looking through the stuff that's near my, my chair because those are usually the ones I work on I did work on my strawberry kittens because I did another stitch with me video So I think I was just working on this like cream color. So it didn't make a lot of progress, just a little bit like one strand probably. I do enjoy this one. Hopefully I had a picture up to compare. Like I said this will be a pretty quick one. remember if this was a new start for this month or a new start last month. Probably last month. But I did work on her. I'm working on the bottom. So, let's knock stuff down. I'm working on all these dark colors. I'm gonna take her with me to Indiana. Just in case I have time to work on anything. Stitch. I swear it looks so much better on camera than it does to my naked eye, and it looks pretty good to my naked eye. I like all the different dark colors. Hopefully I have a picture to put up to show the progress. I have no idea how much I actually stitched. Might have been a little bit, might have been a lot. Depends on when I actually started this. If it was a new start this month and I did a lot, if it was last month. My brain is just not with me anymore. I don't think I worked on her this month. I kept her on hand. If I did, And it was probably just more black. I get bored of just going back and forth on these. I start doing little blocks, do zigzags, and I'll come down here and fill out some of the black around the face. Maybe throw a color in the face and then go back to the black. It's just a lot of black. 
because all of this blue is black. <laughs> but this one is one of my favorites to work on. I just didn't get her out. Except maybe once. I honestly don't remember. Alright, I might have done more than I thought I did. I was looking through my um, wrap-up video for last month. I saw that I completely forgot about this one. So for this one, I mostly did some more of this background color and then I started on the wings. I think that's it. I think all this was already done. I think so. I think it's just some of this and then this color. I think I got frustrated because I got a knot. Couldn't get it untangled and put it away. I made a good progress on it last month. Didn't make hardly any on I didn't make progress on anything this month, I don't think. Um, next. I don't know if I have a picture for this one. If so, I'll put it up. For her, I've just been working on this. I like it because you can kind of see the words now. The Libra. I can probably start it over here. I don't know. I've got some like random bits of collar. I don't know. I might work on her next month. I enjoy working on her, but it's so much confetti. More than I even realized when I first started it. That made me not enjoy stitching on it. Next is the gaze one. I think it's just called like the gaze or gaze. Something like that on the site. It's called fix one eyes on. The natural pattern. And I didn't do much. This one's 14 count, so I have to have good lighting to do it. But I think I mostly worked on was it like a blue? Or I might already had that might have worked on the darker, like the grayish. I think I was working on this. And then I think I'm I can't remember if I had this light colored or not. Anyway, as you can see, not much progress at all. Not for two months because I started this last month. And that is two months worth of progress. It's kind of sad. I, mean, I was working three to four 12 hour shifts a week plus my school work. So I will excuse myself. I didn't do hardly any reading in July. I didn't do hardly any crafting in July. Did a lot of schoolwork and working. And then I quit my job. So you'd think I'd have more time. But I've been my daughter's home. She's getting ready to go back to college. So I've been trying to spend time with her. Plus do work. Plus we're getting ready to go on a trip. We're actually leaving tomorrow for a concert. Well today it's it's early in the morning right now, but today we have a concert and then tomorrow we're leaving for Indiana and I'll be gone for a couple weeks. So we've been trying to prepare for that. I was trying to work ahead on my homework and I did not get as much done as I wanted to. But yeah, I've been looking back at my June wrap up and realized like the I didn't do the stitching on my Red Riding Hood this month. That was last month. Yeah, I just there's not much I did this month. I'm trying to remember if I did this this month or last month. I didn't see it in my my wrap up for last month. So I might have started that this at the very beginning of this month. It's so cute. I was gonna work on it more. It's another 14 count. It's just really cute kittens, but I just haven't been stitching. I mean, I've done more reading or listening because I've been reading a lot of audiobooks the last like week that I had all month. 
I think I burned myself out. I did a lot of challenges last month and read like 20 something books last month. So I think I was just kind of burnt out on actually reading and even listening. So I just did spend a lot of time watching dramas by myself and with my daughter. This is probably the last one. I don't think there's any more I worked on this month. Not much progress. I think this was a new start. I just did. I don't know if you can see that. Like the whites and off whites up in here. I started working my way down. There's butterflies and flowers. It's another kind of nice stitch. I mean, it's it's got some confetti in it. But it's got some good blocks of color too. This one I'll probably keep on hand to work on. But that's pretty much it for my stitching. So there's a, quite a few pieces, but not a whole lot of progress on any of them. Then for other stuff, I did a diamond painting, which I did a diamond paint with me. I thought that was really cute. And I did a, a keychain. There it is. Did that for a whip and review. And I think that's it for crafting. I didn't knit, I didn't latch hook, I did not um, crochet, barely stitched. Uh, for plans for August, I am going to be gone the first two weeks of August. Well, first. 10 days of August and when I come back it's going to be like my final week for these classes I'm taking so I don't know and then I'll be starting new classes I think the last week of August so it's going to be a busy month um, I'm taking a couple cross stitch kits with me to Indiana so I might get some stitching in might not we have a lot of people to visit and we're going to New York also and it's all driving I'm going to go visit my son and then come back to Indiana, stay a few days, and then come back here. And then a couple days later, take my daughter back to her college, her university, where she lives, her apartment. And then that's a couple hours away, and then come back. So yeah, I don't know how much crafting I'll get done, but I'm going to take probably the little cactus one with me, just in case I can do some diamond painting there. I'm going to take a couple cross-stitch kits with me. I think that's it for crafting. I don't think I'm going to take any. There's just not a lot of space and there won't be a lot of time. Oh yeah, I also did this little build with me this month. Which I think it's, it's already live, so. Um, let's see if I get a chance to do another one if I do another small one, I'll probably do a bird. I have several birds, different colors, but I also have some larger kits now that I got. So I don't know if I get a chance, if I'm gonna do a build with me or not, or if I'm just gonna maybe do another stitch with me, have another unboxing going live. I think next week looks like my Stitch With Me Strawberry Kittens Part 3 is live, my Diamond Paint With Me Small Projects live, my FG Normal Unboxings live, and my Build With Me Snails live. So you can look forward to another unboxing video and um, the Cupcake Whip and Review video coming up in the next couple weeks and this will be going live on the first so yeah no set plans for August but I will try to do another stitch with me and maybe another build with me and hopefully 
if I do get a chance to do one of the keychains while I'm in Indiana, hopefully I'll be able to do something with that. Maybe a little time lapse or something. Because I'll just be having my phone. I won't have my computer or anything. So maybe I just do like a little TikTok or something and upload it on here. We will see. I have no idea what I'm going to have time for in August. So yeah. That's my wrap up and my kind of plans. What have you been doing? What have you been up to? Have you been stitching? Have you been cross stitching, knitting, crocheting? All that can go in stitching. Have you been doing any diamond painting? Any other crafts? I keep meaning to do some my sticker books and I still have not done anything past that first one. And I have the color by number one that I was going to do that I never have done any. I just, I don't know why I do that. Do you have any crafts that you get and then you just don't do them? Oh, I do have one thing I really want to do in, in August and it is a beaded embroidery kit. I'm kind of excited about that. I have not done one yet. If you have not done one before, it doesn't look too difficult. It's just, you're just making like half stitches and as you come up you put a bead on it before you go back down and and then you come back and kind of go the other way where you'd usually go down you would come up and go down anyway if you want like a little video then let me know and I will shoot a video on how to do beaded embroidery I have two kits I've unboxed one and the other one will be in the next unboxing so that's something I definitely want to do whenever I come back from Indiana. Mm, yeah, but other than that, no set plans. Um, I think I have another package coming from, I cannot remember. Yeah, I can't remember. I'm not going through my emails, but I have another unboxing coming or another collaboration package coming to to do another unboxing so I'll probably do that in August if it gets here in time they said they sent it and then I got an email saying that it was it wasn't deliverable for some reason that either I wasn't there to sign for it which I've never had to sign for one before or the address was wrong or something which they've sent me stuff before so I don't know but they said they're gonna resend it I don't know what it is <laughs> But, you know, they said to choose some stuff, and then I chose some stuff, and I was like, any of these would work. And they said, like, I'll choose something for you and send it to you, and it'll be a surprise. And I'm like, that's great, because I love surprises. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to that package. All right, I'm going to stop rambling. It's like 4 o'clock in the morning, and i got to get up in a few hours to get ready for the concert. So, I will end this here. Um, thank you so much. I hope it wasn't too rambly and just disjointed. <laughs> And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.